Welcome back to Military Matches HQ, the channel where we dive into the technology, history, and future of military innovation. Today, we're focusing on something that's turning heads across the defense world. The Combat Air Flying Demonstrator, also known as the flying testbed for the United Kingdom's next generation fighter aircraft. So, what exactly is this demonstrator? In simple terms, it's a one-of-a-kind jet aircraft being developed to test and prove advanced technologies for the future combat air system, or FCAS. This system will eventually lead to the creation of the Tempest fighter jet, a project being led by the UK in partnership with Italy and Japan. Think of the demonstrator as a bridge between concept and reality, a way to test the big ideas before they're put into full production. The aircraft itself is being developed by Bay Systems in close collaboration with the Royal Air Force's Rapid Capabilities Office, Rolls-Royce for the engines, Leonardo for avionics, and MBDA for weapons integration. What makes it remarkable is not just its purpose but the sheer speed of development. Britain hasn't built a flying demonstrator of this scale since the Eurofighter Typhoon project decades ago. That puts into perspective just how significant this step really is. The first flight is expected before the middle of this decade, and that's a rapid pace by aerospace standards. Traditionally, aircraft programs can take 10 to 15 years just to reach a prototype stage. With the Combat Air Flying Demonstrator, the UK is compressing that timeline dramatically, proving that digital engineering, advanced simulation, and rapid manufacturing techniques can revolutionize how we design fighter jets. Now, let's talk about the mission of this demonstrator. It isn't just about flying fast or looking sleek. The aircraft is intended to test stealth technologies, new aerodynamics, advanced sensors, and cutting-edge propulsion systems. It will also explore how manned aircraft can work hand-in-hand -hand with unmanned drones, something often referred to as loyal wingmen. Imagine a future fighter flying into contested airspace, supported by autonomous drones carrying weapons or sensors, all working together in one digital combat cloud. That's the kind of future this project is aiming for. Another key point is adaptability. The aircraft is being designed to evolve rapidly as threats change. Instead of taking decades to upgrade, the idea is that new sensors, weapons, or systems could be integrated much more quickly. This is vital because the speed at which rival nations develop new technologies has increased sharply in recent years. To stay ahead, the UK and its allies need a fighter that can be as agile in development as it is in the skies. Of course, none of this comes without challenges. Developing a sixth-generation fighter is enormously expensive and technologically demanding. But by working in partnership with Italy and Japan, the UK is spreading the cost and bringing together a wider pool of expertise. This international collaboration not only strengthens defense ties but also ensures that the final aircraft will be relevant across multiple theaters of operation. When it comes to power, Rolls-Royce is delivering engines that promise greater efficiency, thrust, and thermal management than anything seen before. And that's crucial, because future combat aircraft will need to power not just avionics but potentially directed energy weapons and advanced electronic warfare systems. The demonstrator will give engineers the chance to validate those engine concepts in real flight conditions. So why should we care about the combat air flying demonstrator? Well, it's more than just a prototype. It's a statement that Britain is serious about. Staying at the forefront of air power in the 21st century. It shows that the lessons learned from the Typhoon and the F-35 are being applied to create something even more advanced, something designed for the complex battlefields of tomorrow. As we watch this project progress, we'll be seeing not just the birth of a new aircraft but the foundation of an entire air combat ecosystem. From digital design to artificial intelligence, from manned and unmanned teaming to international cooperation, this demonstrator embodies the future of air warfare. That's all for today's video on the Combat Air Flying Demonstrator. If you enjoyed this deep dive and want more updates on military technology and history, make sure to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. You're watching Military Matches HQ. 
and we'll see you in the next one.